After a full day of uh, travel around Kandahar province and uh, especially in two of the most isolated districts before the takeover of the de facto authority in August, we realized how important has been the support that FAO has been providing over the past few months, especially the wheat seeds that have been distributed, the only wheat that reached farm, the only seeds that reached farmer in this uh, past season due to the end of all government sponsored projects. And uh, the impact that this is having also on the livelihood of people here by keeping them on their fields and able to product. And we see a lot of fields around us uh, which are not planted because of lack of seeds, lack of inputs and lack of water, of course, which remain probably the biggest need, even though the drought this year has been a bit mitigated by a few precipitations. FAO intervention and FAO program for the coming 12 months to 18 months is looking at these three main areas, support to seed production and seed availability in the country, support to livestock production and feed and fodder availability and critically support to irrigation and, and water sector because uh, without water nothing can work in, in agriculture. If support in us really scale up dramatically, we will see uh, really the deterioration of the situation of food security all over these communities. They depend on their food they produce. If they don't have inputs, they cannot produce food. They don't, they don't have other sources of income. They don't have the, the sources of income that they used to have in the past from from the city, from employment, because of the co economic collapse. So at, the, at this juncture, it's critical to enable people to continue to produce food at community level.